me at the bar, leave me at the bar. Hello everybody and welcome to episode 63 of Life on Tap, a multimedia experience now from the heart of NYC. A little bit of a change of scenery today, different room in the place, in the LOT compound here, but uh, same bad time, same bad channel. Um, recording this one in anticipation of um, the multiple things coming up this week, my Rainier replacement coming up very shortly, and uh, hopefully this will come out um, basically right uh, around the time that I'll be getting my uh, nasal correcting surgery. Like I said, it doesn't appear to be so much on the outside, but there's a lot of messed up stuff on the inside, and God knows that Cheryl's had to put up with my snoring for abundantly way too long as it is. But, once again, uh, on to the beer. Now, this one I found on the shelves still, and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna, it's going to be interesting to see how it tastes, because the recommendation is to, right on the bottle, I believe, is actually to just drink this right away and don't celebrate enjoy it right away and I um I you know I just picked it up fairly recently um and um let's hopefully it's still good it's the stone 13th anniversary ale now um this ale um don't know a whole lot about it um all I know that it's a hot monster it's got lots of Chinook uh with dry hop a blend of Simcoe and Centennial so I'm, I'm, uh, this is also a pale malt with crystal, crystal and amber, touch of chocolate. So it's really interesting to see how this thing tastes, and hopefully it has not gotten a little less fresh over the time that it's been out since I believe it was late June is when they when they when they debuted it. All right, let's take a look. A little hard to tell the color in here, but it's got a nice kind of a reddish copperish uh, dark copperish uh, hue to it um, light brown almost there so it's got a great head um, good thing is that I still see a lot of bubbles a lot of carbonation still in there so it looks should like it's still be vibrant enough for us to have let's give this a whiff wow yeah I'm definitely getting the hop storm off of this getting kind of a hint of a uh, I like almost a grapefruit zest off it. It's kind of funny. I'm also getting I'm also getting a lot of the amber, a lot of the amber malts coming off of this. So let's give this thing a, give this thing a shot. Mmm. Wow. For all you non hop heads out there. Maybe this is one that isn't so much for you, but uh, man, it's um, despite it being such a very hoppy, extremely hoppy, um, and it's 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 still puckering in my mouth right now, but it's it's still extremely well balanced, like almost all of Stone stuff out there, which I which I love. Some people like really diss the dry hop beers out there, but I mean, I think this is delightful. I mean, I could, I mean, I could drink this stuff uh, all all day if it um, wasn't for the hefty 9.5 uh, percent uh, alcohol by volume on this thing. Um, I hope that I hope that I um, see many more anniversary ales like this uh, out there from Stone. I, I really enjoyed the the flavor of this one. I mean, maybe not much, not as much as a malt character. Like I said, if you're if you enjoy the hops out there, I think you'll really enjoy this brew. Um, and uh, definitely go check out their website, uh, stonebrew.com, to make sure um, you can catch up on all the speed. You also hear all about how they get around to the anniversary ales, and you can see what um, Mitch Steele and the other people over there on their blog. You know, they talk a lot about this kind of stuff. I definitely encourage you to go over there to the website, take a look at take a look. If you happen to uh, have the taste of this, awesome. If not, go out there. If you if it's still there, it's been about six months, you know, or so, six seven months or so. It's still good right now. Um, yeah, so I'm definitely enjoying that. So I'm gonna head on out right now. I have lots more work to do uh, this uh, this weekend. So um, if you want to get in touch with us, life on tap at lifeontap.net. Uh, website is www.lifeontap.net. You can check me out on the Twitterverse and the Skypeverse. I am NewType2001. And once again on Facebook, I am Facebook.com slash NewType2001. And remember, life's a tap. Drink up till it's dry.